Good morning. I imagine many of you are wondering how the trip was with Julie. Well, by now she's sitting at her desk in New York. I don't know whether she's writing an article or not, but I know she left here with a different mindset and a different understanding about who Mobile is. So why did we bring her down? You know, the fact of the matter is it was really the headline that caught our eye, saying that Mobile is the third most miserable city in America. You know, some of us who know that things can be better in the city, you know, we would uh, say, okay, but we're not the third most miserable city in America. Yes, we can improve. It's kind of like me saying, I can talk about my child, but you can't talk about my child. So we had a situation where Julie was taking a bunch of statistics and, you know, based on no personal knowledge, she wrote the article. So we reached out to her and as you know, she came here. So what was it we wanted to show Julie? You know, we wanted to show her you know, the historical aspects of our city. We want her to see the restaurants. We want her to meet the people. We want her to experience the Southern hospitality, you know, that Mobile is known for. And so she did all that. Because of you, there was just countless opportunities for her to go around town to see your businesses, you know, to eat your food. And so she was very, very impressed, you know, with the people that she met and the things that she saw. I mean, she took an airboat ride in the Delta. She had a tour of, of Austell that was just second to none. She was on a tugboat, you know, viewing the port. I mean, she, she saw things that really a lot of visitors just can't see, but the main thing that she saw was she, she interacted with you. And she had this, that, that Southern hospitality, you know, that we're known for. She experienced that. So it'll be very interesting to see, you know, what she writes about. But one of the things that, that we wanted to make sure that Julie did, we didn't just show her the good. We showed her, you know, all around the community. We showed her the areas that, you know, maybe a, someone else wouldn't show her. Because she really did want to have an understanding about the good and the bad in our city. So we showed it to her. Now, how she'll write about that, you know, we have no idea. Our belief is, is that Mobile is a good city. We can be a great city. And that's why I'm running for mayor. You know, if we will work on improving our crime, if we will work together on uh, being more business friendly for the mom and pops, you know, take the handcuffs off of them so that they can grow their businesses. If we can work with the Mobile Area Education Foundation, public school system, improve public uh, education, you know, <clears throat> we will be on our way to becoming a great city. And then we won't have to worry about one day waking up and, you know, picking up a newspaper and somebody saying we're the third most miserable city in America. You know, really, at the end of the day, uh, I just couldn't sit on the sideline again and just say, well, that's just another bad article being uh, written about Mobile. So we chose to be proactive and to prove, you know, that, that, that we are not a miserable city. We're a good city, but we're on our way to being a great city. So, all in all, great visit with Julie. Uh, we thoroughly enjoyed it, and I hope you'll join with me on August 27th, and we'll start this process of making Mobile a great city. Thank you very much.